<coughs> I vow to all of you who have come to know how to save humanity. It is not our problem only of Bulgaria but of the whole world. Everywhere, all over the world, there is awareness about ecological problems. But means that are adopted are not sufficient enough to stop our deterioration. Now I am here to tell you about some truths which, if we achieve, we can solve our, our, our ecological problem in a much better way. Outwardly, we understand that we have to reduce the machinery. The industrialization, the way it has gone out of proportion, has created lots of problems. Uh, now to outwit it, outwit the growth of industry, we have to take to something, a uh, simple life, by which we do not use too many things. There is a way of understanding that we have unnecessarily expanded our acquisition uh, temperament. Now this uh, is a difficult thing, it will take too much time to change the people of uh, their awareness to understand. All these things cannot be reversed very easily, I understand. And these factors which create Pollution cannot be controlled very easily by just protesting or by shouting or doing all kinds of things. It is a money orientation of man which is working out his whole lifestyle. And nobody is worried about the future, what's going to happen. So <clears throat> we have to now think what should we do. In the evolutionary process, as you know, people developed immunity to different obstacles. Animals developed new type of limbs and things according to the atmosphere they had to face. Is there a possibility that we human beings in these modern times can develop an immunity to this attack of ecological problems? If we could do that, then there is a question of great survival of the project. I'm very thankful uh, to this organization which has invited me and uh, I could have spoken much more about the sea uh, preservation and all that uh, because I travel a lot and I see a lot. But one must have wisdom and humility. It's a serious problem and we have to think about our progeny. So I'm thankful to this organization which has invited me uh, and because of that I could tell you about uh, the immunity, how to develop within yourself. They say it takes time, I think it does not. Uh, international Movement, Echo Forum for Peace. For your efforts to evolve the human spirit, and for your contribution in the struggle for peace and brotherhood between the nations, to avoid the ecological catastrophe of humankind, Mrs. Nirmala Srivastava is awarded the title of Honorable